Hi right, guys, I'm playing I'm playing uh, Fortnite on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. I'm using a uh, DualSense controller to play the game. I told you guys uh, if you if you want to do cloud gaming on the Samsung you can. And the good thing about cloud gaming as well, as long as the game supports um, the DualSense like con uh, supports basically uh, controllers, you should be able to use uh, DualSense in the game. Uh, games I've played on cloud gaming. Uh, I'm, I know uh, you guys may know this, but it's Fortnite, obviously, uh, because it's a free-to-play game. But not just free-to-play, it's fun. It's a fun game to play. And on cloud gaming, especially on the Samsung, and like I told you, it's much easier. I prefer, I prefer playing it on my phone. I told you guys before why, and you'd probably say why. Uh, is it the graphics? No. I can play that on my laptop, which, which is the one in the background there. It's the MSI Raider GE67HX gaming laptop with Intel i7-12800HX, 16 cores, 24 threads, 8 efficiency cores, 8 performance cores. It also has NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080 Ti laptop uh, graphics card, which has got uh, 16 gigs of VRAM. So it's fully equipped. It can play any game. Um, I think it's just a texture thing. If you want to play games better and you, you know, just, I'll tell you something about VRAM that I didn't know, because uh, I know a lot of people probably think, oh, you play a lot of games. Well, not really. Um, I play a select few games, but the, I'll tell you something that I found interesting about this, that a lot of people won't tell you about uh, VRAM. I discovered something about VRAM. It's, it's, not, it's not like having 16 gigs of VRAM, you think you play every game, like on, on Ultra, no. To me, what I've discovered is the Ultra part only happens if the game gets updated regularly and it's meant to be played on certain uh, devices like Steam Deck. Every time a game gets, um, um, like, I wouldn't say modified, but when it gets improved or improvised, uh, you know, like mods or whatever they do to make the game more playable, that's when I discover that um, the game will be much better to play on my laptop. If you get what I'm saying, as, as it gets updated, certain things may be removed or reduced, and then it's obviously going to play much better on my laptop. And then I'm going to like say this, and I, I don't know if I'm reaching out to someone who's going to hear me, but uh, Valve did stop actually saying the minimum graphics required in games was uh, six. It's now actually eight. It's actually eight now. So if, if, you have a, if you have a laptop with 6 gigs of VRAM, my suggestion would be try and get uh, another one, you know. I'm not, I'm not saying, I'm not saying if, if you like a laptop, no problem. I'm just saying I think it's uh, much better to invest in a laptop with 8 gigs of VRAM. Because Steam updates its uh, website all the time, you know, the store. And the games, like it always says the minimum recommended for that game. You know, like Our Creators is coming. Our Creators is a very good. It's an alien game. It's, um, it's like uh, Destiny 2. It's free to play, but it's graphically intensive. So I would say, I would suggest, uh, e even if you look at the minim minimum graphic setting for uh, Our Creators on Steam, on the Steam store, it does say 8 gigs, uh, 8 gigabyte VRAM. Right, my point of talking about VRAM to you guys is this. I discovered that VRAM is not as important as people think. Now, I know a lot of people probably think, well, you keep talking about yours having 16 gigs of VRAM. Yes, I do, because that's what it uh, has. But uh, my whole point is this. Uh, the VRAM, I think, just allows your laptop to play the game. It's not, like, graphically intensive. It's uh, not a texture type of... Um, improver you know is it, when i say improver i don't mean like you play it on the steam deck i got steam deck let's say i'm playing um i don't know what game to mention i, I let's say i'm playing war robot frontiers i can play war robot frontiers on my steam deck on very low graphic settings but on the laptop i can play it on epic right the only reason for that is because of the v1 but what i'm talking about mostly is certain games just work better with that amount of v you understand so call of duty 3 modern warfare like for example i play it on steam 
and that game does require at least if you want to do a uh, emote press down and then that just select and that's it it's down emote and select the emote and um, that's all and it's automatic so anyway um vram i discovered and i discovered this very late later on in the gaming world vram is not as important as people may think vram is just important when it comes to the game the type of game you want to play you understand i i don't know if i'm reaching out to anyone out there who's probably in the same books as me and thinking well yes you're right and yes you're kind of wrong i think i'm right because i think this vram thing it's not it's not valid i mean you find a lot of graphics cards can do they give you like 24 gigs of vram you know most of the time and you think wow that's fantastic but i i've discovered this and when i play call of duty it only requires 3.5 i think 3.5 gigabytes of vram to play it on ultra that means that it it could probably work on the steam deck on ultra if the steam deck had that 4 gig of vram on it you know so let's say it wasn't a it wasn't actually using i don't know what to say the word let's say it wasn't actually using um that that memory uh from the ram the ram itself like it was um having a graphics card inside it i hope the steam deck 2 comes with a graphic card seriously because that that's just gonna be a game changer and i get this thing is this fire oh it's the wooden thing i mean the stone thing i wanted fire right so basically what happened there you know i clicked on x and it just wouldn't do that's so weird right let me get my g-wagon and blow this place up what's that is that a sniper looks like a sniper weapon you know i don't like this thing man i don't like these let me get this weapon yeah that's a sniper isn't it should be gonna get my g-wagon start me radio on and then start playing some beats right i'm gonna explain something if the steam deck had come with not just four gig i think you need more like at least this doesn't have a radio on it does it oh the radio is on now right so if the steam deck had a graphics card in it for example i think the steam deck would have been a proper gaming uh it would have been really good for gaming you understand what i mean where are these people at find somebody oh they're building right right okay right me oh damn damn i almost got him but i got shot <laughs> No, I got shot in the process. Ah, it's a pity. Okay, so they're opening something over here. I can see they're opening something. I think it's one of those uh, loft things where you get the other chests, isn't it? They are waiting for that to open. I'm gonna open this. Try and get these ones. Right, so my general point is, wait, is this opening? Oh, 2M. What's 2M? So what happened to the people that were here then? They're all dead. They must have been fighting for it then. Oh, and it's taking some time to open as well. Right. Uh, my whole point... Oh, oh my God. Ah, pity. My whole point is this. I feel like VRAM is just a gimmick. Because uh, to play... Call of Duty 3 Modern Warfare, um, it doesn't even require, because I set mine to the highest, 9 gigabyte of VRAM, seeing that I got 16 gigs there, right? But it doesn't even use that. It just uses like 3.5 something gigabyte. That's it. That's all it uses. So I, I think it's just a gimmick thing. I don't know if someone out there would agree with me. Wait, is this one better? I want fire. Ah, yes. Thank you so much for that. I don't I don't want that uh, thing. Maybe I should have kept it, right? Should have kept it maybe. 
Uh, let's see, what other weapons do I have? You know what? Let me, let me get rid of this um, sniper thing. And I'll take this one. There you go. So I got two of them now. Where are people? Where are people? Mm, don't know where people are fighting at the moment. Oh, it's showing me this golden thing. Oh, am I supposed to find something? Is that what this is all about? Oh, I'm supposed to locate something. All right, I didn't get that. That's why it's glowing, isn't it? Wait, let me... I want to redirect this. Uh, yeah, let me do this. And then let me do this. Get this gun back. And then get this one. Oh, wait a minute. What's happening? Right. So basically, what I'm saying to you guys is this. I think it's a gimmick. Um, why am I saying it's a gimmick? Because I don't think... Wait. What's happening? Oh, Iron Warrior. What's an Iron Warrior? Oh, wow. Look at this. That's like, um, what you call this weapon? It's like an RPK, L I mean LMG. That's what I'm looking at. Right, so basically, I think it's just a gimmick. I know you're going to think, well, maybe yes, maybe no. The reason why I'm saying this is if the Steam Deck had come with the graphics card, I think it would have been a very good gaming machine. Uh, I mean, more than what it is. I mean, it is a good gaming machine, but I'm, I'm just saying... It could have been much better, you know? Oh, wait, there's a banana thing. Uh, let's see, can I swap that out? Let me eat the banana. I want to get that shotgun back. Let me get the shotgun. Wait, let me go back to the shotgun. Right, so I, I know what you guys are probably thinking. What am I talking about? I'm talking about the fact that I think the Steam Deck could have been much better than what it was. That, that's my personal opinion. Oh, wow. I need to get out of here. Okay. I'm just afraid if I go there, someone's going to run down here, shoot me, and then I'll be like, oh, why did I stay so long? Okay. Right. All right. Wait. I don't need the other shield, do I? I mean, I don't really need it that much. Could have, would have been useful, but you've, you've all seen how I play the game. I'm not that good. so <laughs> It's just going to block a few shots, and that's it. And then I'll be dead. And then you'll be like, what, what was the whole point? You get what I'm saying? I, I, don't, think, I don't think it's that useful. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just looking at it that, that way. Wait, wait, wait. Bam, 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 bam. Thank you very much. Thank you for making it easy to die. Come on, man. Don't shoot me like that. Let's talk about it first. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to emote now. Yes. I'm going to dance every time I get someone. Right. Uh, so basically, what I'm saying is, why am I talking about Steam Deck? Uh, because I've got a Steam Deck. And uh, I feel like if the Steam Deck had only come with a graphics card in it, with actual VRAM, and then added that 4 VRAM from the memory, it would have had like 8 gigs of VRAM. It would have been a really handy uh, device for gaming. You know what I mean? It is good for games, but uh, it will, I'm, I'm saying it would have been better. Oh, uh, no. These guys are moving too quickly, man. Let me get me self. Oh, I, I thought this guy was going to get this thing. I thought he was going to get this. Where are people gone? Okay. They're over there. Oh, my God. Oh, come on. Ah. Can't even get this, dudes. Come on. Come on, come on. Yes, thank you. That was nicely done. Let me crack you. Thank you so much. Thank you for making that painless. I wanted to talk to you. I want to sing you a song. And then I want to drive away. Oh, wait. Ah, thank you so much. I, I like you. I like you so much. I wanted to give you a shotgun surprise. Right, let me ooh, slide down. Nice one. Oh, I, I forgot to dance. I forgot to dance. I forgot to dance. I'm going to dance now. See, every time I get them.
All right. Right, let's see, what are we doing? Oh, let me let me start building. Let me build, let me build. Oh, this game. I was playing um, those other games, but they were irritating me quite a lot. I hope someone just allows me to build for once, not try to shoot me while I'm building, because that's so irritating. You know, I miss I miss the old Fortnite. You know, like I hope it does come back to iPhone because this game really brought up communities. You know, you understand? It was fun to play back then when people understood teamwork, understood what this game was all about. Building, they used to build all the way up. I used to like that man. You know, just just coming back, playing this game on my iPhone. And just watching how people used to build. That's what made me love this game so much. You simply don't get that now. And people don't seem to understand the whole point of it. Like, it's just fun. That's what makes Fortnite, Fortnite building. That's what made it so different. But um, you don't get that with people. And that's a pity. I don't know if anyone agrees with me. I just like the general building of it. Ah, you see that the thing is what I try to do is I build and then I'll leave it and I'll let the other people join in because if you keep building, they want to destroy it, right? But if you let someone else start building like the opposite team, you just hope that they have common sense and they want to build. You understand? I still got building materials. Wow, look at that. That's quite nice. Look at what this person is doing. Honestly, destroying my my build, <laughs> my my decorations. And for what? Because you're jealous. Oh wait, wait, wait! I'm stuck now. Wait, if if I do this, how do I create a, a hole here or something? Right. Let me do this one. I do that one. Do this. Go there. Do that one. Do this one. Do this one. Do that one. Oh, check. They're actually building now. Someone's woken up. That's nice. No, this this is why I like Fortnite since before. I mean, that's just me. That's what attracted me to Fortnite. Right. And now that I've got no more building materials, you see what I do? I don't abandon it. I want people to keep building it. So I leave it alone. I go away from it. There you go. Nice one. Where are the people at? I can't see where people are going. I can't see where anyone is. I need to find them. Oh, they're over there. Nice one. There. They're, they're, they're in the opposite direction. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Chill for me. I, I want to talk to you for a second. Yeah, I wanted to tell you something. I wanted to tell you something, but you didn't let me tell you. But I was trying to tell you. Just give me a second. I want to sing you a song. What happened to that building? It's still there. Or did they take it down? Knowing these uh, types of people. What happened to it? Is it gone? Ah, oh, pity. That was a nice building. While it lasted. Come on. Let me talk to you for a second. I just want to tell you how beautiful you are. Oh, nice one. <laughs> that didn't last long, did it? That didn't last long. I like these shotguns. I didn't realize these shotguns had this automatic firing thing. I hate the old ones though. Right, let's find somebody else. There you go. You want to do something you can't. Let me talk to you for a second. Oh no, come on. Man, how, how do you run out of stuff? 
Ah, damn it. They got me again. They got me again. Wait, uh, my thing's working. Wait, I think I got fire on me. Where is it? Where's everyone? I need to talk to someone. I need to talk to someone and sing them a song. I need to sing someone a song, 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 song. There you go. I'm singing everyone's songs because I love everybody. I want to talk to you. Wow, we won. Nice one. I got the final kill as well. You see that? I got the final kill when I kicked that dude. You see? 100. Look at the XP that I got. I got the final kill. Nice one. See, look at all my rewards. That was a fun game, guys. Uh, DualSense controller, uh, Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5, and a um, the BSP Dash D3 Bluetooth controller, and um, Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5, obviously. Uh, that was Fortnite Mobile. Thank you, guys.